today's video I'm gonna be showing you guys how to um, play online when you're using Steam tools. So first thing you want to do is check the link in the description. I put this website. Um, a lot of people think this website is a scam and it's a virus. Um, a lot of people think it's a virus, but they have a whole page on the website proving that it's not a virus and multiple people are saying that it's not a virus. The only time when you can get a virus is when you're downloading it wrong because sometimes there you can get pop-up ads which can trick you into thinking that you're downloading the correct thing. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you just search up your game right here and then once you search it up and then you click it, your page should look like this. Um, then, uh, first of all, to show that it's this is how it looks before. As you can see, right? Um, so yeah, you click download, repo multiplayer. Not, not, well, sorry. Also, the page even shows you how to do online. I'm gonna be showing you how to do that too. Um, if it says torrent, don't worry about that. To only focus on the f online fix of me. Not the only fix, the only focus on the to know that you're on the right thing and it's not a pop up. This look, it's the same as this. And there's a whole bunch of controllers, you know. You click, it even says, you know, rules. Almost it's a same like this. You click download file from server. Um. Okay, so you click save, and then you run the application, and you click OK. It should say run mouse, what, mal, malice, whatever, blah, blah, blah. I already did this, so it's not showing it for me. You should you click more, you click more info, and then you click run anyway. Um, if you get that red big thing, I'll just, yeah. You click next, you click browse, and you find your game. Uh... Find your game, go to program files x86, you go to Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and you find the game. It's not gonna work if you do some random game. You click next. As you can see, it's not gonna work. Obviously. Okay. So you click repo or whatever no whatever it is, you know. You, this these things are optional. You don't gotta do that. Click finish. You click minimize. You minimize it. You can delete this. Uh, and then your game should look like this. Okay, you're not done. If you're doing repo, you, then you're not done. But if you're doing any other game, okay, shit, guys, make sure. Look to check on. If you want to know you're done, it says like. You, if you want to know you're done, it just look at the steps. Um, and but if you're using repo, you're not done yet. Like look, as you can see, you gotta read the steps basically, guys. It's and you're the per if you want to play online with your friends, your friends have to also do this, guys. Just to let you know. Okay, but if you're doing repo, honestly, no, well, this is pretty simple. You go on photonengine.com, also gonna be linked in the description. Um, you make an account. I already made an account, but you just make an account and you basically click create a new app. You click multiplayer game. Don't worry about this, whatever. You're good, okay? You click create. Once you're done that, you click, you see this thing it has app id you see this you click it and you copy it and if you're playing repo you send it to all your friends and by the way they all, remember I, I said this again they also have to do this they also have to download that blah, blah, blah. if they bought the game they can still do it they can still do it guys don't worry so you copy this thing right and then you go on your files and then you go on photon config you open this and it should be this thing. You highlight the whole thing and then you click Control V. You click File. You click Save. And they also have to use this just to let you know. And when they 
launch the game. They just, it, if they want to join, they have to put the, the same app ID. If they, yeah, you're done. Um, yeah. You are done. Yes, basically. Yeah. Um, uh, if you have any questions, let me know. I hope this helped you guys. Uh, go on my Discord server, and if you can, you can ask a question by leaving a comment. Or you go to my Discord server, and then you could just ask help. You know, I'm also gonna be making live streams. You know, to live, like to help to help you guys live by answering each of your guys' questions. So yeah, hope this helped. Uh, please support my channel. Um, I'm trying my best to increase its sub, its sub count. So um, yeah. Um. Discord, my Discord server is in the description, and um, pardon me, my Twitch is also on my profile. Please sub, just follow on that, and uh, have a great day, guys.